Hey, what's up everyone? It's Real Fatties here. And today what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys how to properly bait your hook. What we're gonna be using today is we're gonna be using salmon eggs and we're also gonna be using coon shrimp. So I hope this gets into helping you catch more fish. Now let's get right into how you set this up. All right, what's up everyone? It's Real Fatties here. What I'm gonna be doing today is I'm gonna show you guys how to properly put bait on your hook. So what we're gonna go ahead and do right here, what we got is we got our two watt hook and this has got an egg loop knot. So as you can see here, you can go ahead and pull out the back loop here. This setup that I'm running is a float fishing setup. I will put the link in the description below for how I rig this up. I've made a tutorial on that. So what I'm gonna do first of all, so I'm gonna grab out a nice sack of eggs. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on top of my cooler there. I'm gonna grab out my scissors. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna cut off a nice chunk of the eggs, about that size. It all depends on where you're gonna be fishing, how much eggs you're gonna be using. What I'm doing right now is I'm fishing for king salmon, so that's a perfect size clump. What I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go through the skein one time. See, it's through the skin there. Then I'm gonna go ahead and go through it again, through it again. I'm gonna go ahead and keep threading this through the, through the skein here until I know it's nice and on there tight. And then what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna grab my egg loop knot, which I have right through the back here. I'm gonna go ahead and bring it through the bottom of the eggs down here. I'm gonna go ahead and cinch it up tight. So right there, now my bait is gonna go ahead and float through the water very efficiently and it's not gonna fall off. I should get a good 20 or 30 casts with this before I'm gonna need to rebait. So what I wanna get into next is how to properly put coon shrimp on your hook. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and drop right down here. I'm gonna go ahead and drop my Instagram. Go ahead and go over there and give me a follow and don't forget to like and subscribe. Now let's get into showing you guys how to rig up the coon shrimp. Nice coon shrimp here. Okay. Once you get out the coon shrimp, what you're gonna wanna do is get your container back in the cooler. You wanna keep things cold. So once you have your coon shrimp here, same concept, you got your egg loop knot. You're gonna go ahead and feed this through the back of the tail going into the back of the head, just like this. You're gonna have it sticking out the head right there. Feed it back through the back shank of the hook. Go ahead and grab your egg loop knot. Go ahead and go through the tail, if you can see it right there. So I got it through the tail and we're not tightening this up tight, we're just enough to hold it. And then we can go ahead and fish that. Hope that helps you guys catch more fish and know how to properly bait your hook. I know the coon shrimp can be a little bit confusing. The most important thing is that you're making sure that it's um, the egg loop is coming down and it's grabbing that tail from the backside. So then you can loop it up. And if you, as long as you're coming through the backside of the head, when you go up the shank, it will be right. Now, you guys could really help me out by leaving a like and a subscribe to help this channel grow. We're trying to get it to a thousand subscribers and we cannot do it without you. Thank you and peace.